Hi, I'm Kat, the book tart, and I want to share with you my most recent book haul. I just got back from the Romantic Times Book Lover Convention 2013 in Kansas City, and it was amazing and awesome, and I am exhausted, <laughs> and I have not caught up on anything, and I got sick, <coughs> um, but it was worth it. I had a wonderful time and met a lot of people that I've been friends with online, and now I could hug them for real. And I got a lot of books given to me, which is like um, a kid in a toy store, a candy store. It's heaven. But I also bought some books. They have two book fairs. They have their indie and ebook book sale, and then they have their ginormous Saturday book fair. Um, and I'll show you the books that I collected, that I purchased. And this year, I actually bought less than I have previously. Um, I've been trying to be good and trying to get my to be read pile a little bit more under control. <laughs> but, all right, here's the first one. This is um, by Gina Lamb and it's called The Geek Girl and the Scandalous Earl. <laughs> and I met Gina and she's all pin -y like me and I read the synopsis of her book and it looks um, darling, it's contemporary romance. Um, an avid gamer, Jamie Morton loves to escape into online adventure, but when she falls through an antique mirror into a lavish bedchamber 200 years in the past, she realizes she may have escaped a little too far. Oh, okay. Uh, I knew that too, so um, time travel. <laughs> um, and Micah Axelby, the Earl of Dunnington. So yum. Check that out. I also, as I was walking and stopping and passing out my business cards for the book tart, I picked up In a Fix, In a Fix by Linda Grimes, and it's urban fantasy. It has a quote on the back from Vicki Peterson, whom I adore, with her um, Zodiac series. And so this one, In a Fix, says, meet human chameleon, I don't know how you say this name, C-I-E-L. Halligan Chill? Mm, I don't know. Um, <laughs> uh, snagging a marriage proposal for her client while on an all-expense-paid vacation should be a simple job. Um, aura adapter extraordinaire. A uh, kind of human chameleon. She's able to take on her client's appearance. So, that one in a fix. That looks really good. Oh, and it's signed. The fun thing about getting these books at the book convention is you get them signed by the authors which just makes me so excited. I mean, seriously, authors are my rock stars. I love storytellers. <gasps> oh, 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 okay. Um, I, if you know this, I mean, if you watch me, you know I'm a print junkie. Yes, I read eBooks, but I really love print books. So I had to pick up JC Daniels' Night Blade. This is the second book in her Kobana series. It's um, a pseudonym for Shiloh Walker, and Shiloh Walker was there, and I already own um, Night Song, and I needed Night Blade in print, and what better way to get it than from her, and it's signed to Cat. This is an amazing urban fantasy series, and I highly, highly recommend it. Um, yeah, really good. So, ooh, Racing for the Sun by Amy Lane. This is, it was so wonderful to meet Amy, Amy my Amy. Um, I have adored her for about four or five years and I followed her into all the different genres she writes. This is a contemporary MM and I'm looking forward to reading it. She writes amazing, heart-wrenching, angsty characters full of love and family and hope. So, Racing for the Sun by Amy Lane. And let's see what she wrote for it. Oh. I, I love the, uh, yeah, the signing. <laughs> okay, what else do we have? <gasps> oh, 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 Masquerade. Masquerade's by Nicole Flockton. She's one of my besties, and I had not met her in person until the Romantic Times convention, and I hugged her and squeezed her, and I had to pick up her book, Masquerade. It's a, um, it's a really yummy contemporary romance. Um, yeah. And it's mine. And last but not least, I picked up Innocent Darkness, the Aether Chronicles, book one. It's by Susan Lazier. And 
says a hoverboard appears in her rearview mirror. This is the Los Angeles Air Patrol, a voice boomed. I command you to land your vehicle in the name of the law. It is a um, steampunk YA and the cover. I mean, look at that cover. She has blue hair for goodness sake. I love her. So I definitely am excited to read about Nolly Braddock and uh, read this adventure. So I will show you pictures on my website of the books I received as gifts from the convention. And I'll be doing a giveaway for some of the swag and some of the goodies I collected. And I will post my pictures as well. Make sure you check out thebooktart.com for more funness and contests and interviews and reviews. And just book flailing. <laughs> All right, thanks from the book tart. And I lost my remote. <laughs>